I feel bees on me. Oh! Is that guy biting my arm? That's, That's a mosquito. A mosquito. <laughs> Maya, come look at the big bee. You know what bees do? What? They're gonna land on these flowers, and then they're gonna land on these flowers and pollinate them, and then we're gonna get all kinds of vegetables. I know it's a little early to teach you about the birds and the bees, but we're gonna learn how bees make honey. Did you wear this bee outfit purposely because we're going to see bees today? Yes. What about your sister? Yes. She's Layla? She's a bee too. It's apparently one of the longest running, fourth generation, honey-making families. Let's go say hi. hi. Good morning. Well, hello, and welcome to Dickie Bee Honey. Thank Look you. Look at our two little beautiful honeybee princesses here today. We brought our own honeybees. We're gonna teach you a little bit about the honeybees and see how busy they are collecting pollen and honey today. Let's go see what's going on in there. This is a frame of bees we just went over to pick up. Whoa. Whoa. So you can see they're very busy. Oh, I can hear them buzzing. Yeah. Though. They are busy bees. So this is actually them busy at work. Feel the beeswax, push in on it. Feels really cool. And smell it. Smell it? Mm -hmm. What does it smell like, man? Smell like anything? It smells like honey. Oh, it smells like honey a little bit. So the wonderful thing about bee pollen is it's the only food that we can survive on. It carries all of our 22 amino acids, all of our vitamins, and all of our minerals. Pollen? Pollen. Because it builds up your immunities against asthma, allergies, and hay fever. And it'll taste differently, and it just depends on what pollens they collect from what flowers. It's got a tendency to maybe be a tad bit bitter. It's the aftertaste that's like, it's like... Hey, can we stand here? You know where these powdery. come from? Woody. Oh, I can tell that it's pollen, though. We're like licking flowers, basically. We're gonna see the honey making. See how they make honey? Come on in, guys. So this is our production room. This is where we pour all the honey. Just pull this down, you ready? Yes. Whoa. The only food that'll never go bad is honey. Beautiful honey. You smell that? Honey? Does that smell good? <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Thanks. Good job, Scott. Maya, we'll make oh, something no. delicious with this. Also, another product that comes from the hive is propolis. Smell that. You're scaring me. Isn't that great? Mm -hmm. Is this poop? Is this poop? Nope. This is, <laughs> this is how, if you're sick, you gotta go to the doctor. Bees can't go to the doctor. They take propolis. So they coat their hive with it to kill any viruses, bacteria, or fungus. Do you use this to fight off any diseases? We uh, dilute it in alcohol, make a tincture out of it, and I'll take two to three drops every day. But when I'm sick, I'll take like 20 drops for about four days. It's like a bee remedy. This is the bee remedy. We call it the bee's penicillin. Okay, girls, daddy's gonna go check out the bees. There's over a million bees over there. I lift this right off. Yeah. <laughs> no fear. They smell that. They smell the fear. This Are you touching gonna them? Be putting the honey, yeah. Can I touch them? Yeah. Oh. Oh. My lord. All right, Scott, what I want you to do is put your fingers down here and just pick that frame up. Okay. Just oh, go nice on. and slow. Right, this seems like a really good idea. So oh. this is a typical honey super. I feel bees on me. Oh, is that guy biting my arm? That's, That's a mosquito. A mosquito. <laughs> I think the mosquitoes are worse than the honeybees. So you this super's coming off. Oh my. The queen is usually in the middle. You've got to be kidding me. That is outrageous. There you go, now you pick them up. So grab them the other way. That's a drone. That's and go a drone. go out and try to mate with another queen? Yep. This is where the, the queen will live with her babies. There's a queen. Oh, there she is. Wow. <clears throat> Everyone moves out of her way. Yeah, you see that, eh? So right now we have a pollen trap over here, Scott. Oh my lordy. So that's bee pollen. And how does it fall off of their legs? The bees come up through the screen and into the brood chamber. Yeah. And it just it basically just lodges it off them while they uh, climb through. Obviously, some of them are visiting different flowers because it's different color pollen. Look at all the different colors, yeah. That's so cool. So this is a brand new hive. Yes, yeah, this is what I would do at my house. Yes, look at all the glistening honey in here. You can poke your hive tool right in there, Scott. Poke this guy right in yep. there? Yep. 
You want to taste oh, some real honey. Wow. Oh, it doesn't get any fresher. I'm really impressed with the bees, and it's awesome to see how, with our organic garden, this is how things get pollinated. I've never stood in the middle of almost two million bees like this and been so calm in my life. You're doing very well. I'm impressed. They're in my hair. They're in your hair. That's where Not I draw the, hair. the line. Okay. That's where I draw the line. Cut. Cut. <laughs> we are excited because have a look at that broccoli. Hooray! Show mom what you're doing. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. If you missed what we did last week, it's right here. If you want to see what we did next, it's right here. Check out both if you have time.